Welcome to the Battle Drill Devotional Podcast with Captain Rob Westwood Payne. Today is Friday, the 11th of October. This week on the Battle Drill Daily Devotional Podcast, we seek to deepen our faith, find joy in trials, embrace God's mercy, and anchor our lives in eternity. Our two scripture readings today can be found in 1 Peter chapter 1 and verses 6 to 7 and Romans chapter 5 verses 3 to 5. One Peter chapter one and verses six to seven say, So be truly glad. There is wonderful joy ahead, even though you must endure many trials for a little while. These trials will show that your faith is genuine. It is being tested as fire tests and purifies gold, though your faith is far more precious than mere gold. So when your faith remains strong through many trials, It will bring you much praise and glory and honour on the day when Jesus Christ is revealed to the whole world. And Romans chapter 5 and verses 3 to 5 say, We can rejoice too when we run into problems and trials, for we know that they help us develop endurance. And endurance develops strength of character, and character strengthens our confident hope of salvation. And this hope will not lead to disappointment, for we know how dearly God loves us, because he has given us the Holy Spirit to fill our hearts with his love. At first, they were called embedded menus. Then they received a new name, hyperlinks. Without them, our research, writing, shopping and studying would all slow to a crawl. How could we navigate our smartphones or PCs without them? How could we take advantage of touchscreens without them? How could we perform drag and drop without them? We'd be working through long and laborious menus instead. In today's reading, we find a theological hyperlink. It helps us navigate how we can get on in the real world without dissolving into despair. Peter and Paul both give us an unexpected view of suffering, portraying it not merely as a challenging phase, but as an essential process in refining our faith and character. Peter encourages believers to rejoice in trials, knowing that these hardships reveal the genuineness of our faith. Paul echoes this sentiment in Romans by stating that suffering produces perseverance, which leads to character and ultimately, hope. Think about a recent struggle you've faced. It's natural to want to escape suffering, but what if we embraced it as a tool in God's hands? Reflect on how enduring this hardship has shaped you. Perhaps it made you more patient, empathetic, or reliant on God's strength instead of your own. Start by jotting down recent hardships you've encountered. Next to each one, note any positive changes that have emerged from the experience. Have you developed greater empathy for others going through similar situations? Has your prayer life deepened? Recognising these benefits helps in shifting our mindset from a victim mentality to one of growth and opportunity. Lord, help me to view suffering as an opportunity for growth rather than a punishment. Strengthen my faith through trials and use them to shape my character. Thank you for your promise that suffering produces perseverance, character and hope. Amen. And today's reflection question for you to think about throughout your day is this. How can embracing God's purpose in your suffering change the way you experience trials and challenges? Please do join me again tomorrow 
for the last of this week's Battle Drill Daily Devotionals as we look at living as a community of hope. If you would like to subscribe to Captain Rob's Battle Drill Devotional, wherever you choose to listen to podcasts, or if you'd like to receive them direct to your inbox, head to www.equippinghispeople.com forward slash devotional and follow the instructions.